Hello guys, this is Cosmo and welcome back to SnowRunner. Uh, we're gonna pick up exactly where we left off last time. Uh, we are in Drummond Island with our fleet star. We have not unlocked the garage, I have no idea where it is. Um, honestly have no idea where that where it is. I'm, I'm kinda hoping it's close. <laughs> we went in here hoping that it would be just close enough so we can get back to what we were actually doing, but apparently we got lost in the Drummond uh, Islands here. Um, also picked up a quest early on to uh, get some um, to help some dudes, which just got stuck in the mud, and we just so utterly completely happened to run across them here, uh, which are these dudes in the folk uh, in the Scout 800. It's uh, completely uh, empty fuel-wise, so. This is literally a drag job. Uh, again, I don't specifically want to do it, but if I'm here, and again, uh, pretty much as I am right now, it's a pretty bad uh, situation for me. Uh, but if I'm here, might as well give it a shot and see if I can uh, pull these guys out to safety. Now, going back the route I came in would be kind of a bad idea, and I have to get these all the way back here. So I'm gonna see maybe I can maybe I can do a different route. This twisty bend here is pretty pretty bad. Really pretty bad. And technically there is a, another option for me if I can cross there, but that's gonna be hard. I can also see if I can get up here. I'm gonna give that a shot just now, see if this is climbable. By the way, if I do uh, dropping this water, I am entirely dead because this is horribly deep water. If you look, that's a ship there, and I very doubt that I, I can see the bottom here. So let's uh, see if we can go through here. Okay, park it. Okay, uh, so this is indeed an option. So let's uh, kind of, kind of, kind of wished that this is bad come on okay i don't care you're coming with me i don't care what's happening you are literally coming with me now let's break it let's use the front there it's out of fuel so its engine does not help us in any way shape or form let's use low let's use differential lock let's take off the handbrake and Let's see if we can do this. The problem here is we don't really have any uh, connection points, any winch points. And then I can give these guys some fuel, but I don't think I want to, to be fair. I think I'd rather keep the fuel for myself. But as long as we get this little truck up here, everything is going to be fine. Uh, kind of wish... Can I... Okay, perfect. If I raise the winch, it stays there. I just need to use the winch myself and get myself over this hump here. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That, 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 that was bad. Okay. So far, so bad. Let's get that clogged up. this I don't care about your engine I really don't care about your engine you are just coming with me wherever I'm going tiny car let's not make this into more of BDSM uh, pun than it already is okay let's stop pulling with the winch actually yeah let's might as well get a bit closer and from this point onwards we are free to We can get this off of this island. Let's break it for a moment. Let's check out where we are. Okay, so basically the best option for us would be to drop down here. Uh, there's nothing for us to do here. 
Although I would totally hate it if this was this would be the garage somehow. Anyways, doesn't really matter. Uh, yeah, let's drop down here somehow. I'm not exactly sure how, but let's drop down here, cross over, and hmm. Yeah, I guess. I guess we should probably take this route. Even if I, you know, uh, flip over or something, might as well uh, get this uh, quest started. Okay, so I actually need to take a left here at some point, don't I? Okay. I'm fearing that I don't want to flip over. That's the imp most important part here, which I don't think it's going to happen. But the second most important thing is I don't want to... Because that will definitely get stuck around that tree. And when that happens, yeah, we will have problems. So let's do max pull of the winch here. Let's actually see if we can go up through here just enough so we can uh, okay let's release the winch is it fine yeah it's fine in the move great okay I don't really want to push that out the way but oh well Do this right now just in case that thing falls. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This is bad, 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 bad. Break. Ooh, okay. Not how I wanted it to go, but I'm okay with this outcome. Okay. Uh, engine on. We still have a fair bit of fuel, so I'm not to worry about that. And break off. Ooh, wow, this is such a tight corner here. I'm kind of... Uh, yeah, I should probably just drop that and... I'll pick it back up again when we have a bit of uh, space between us. I don't want it to actually get that stuck to me. Okay. So, let's do this. I don't think I've spent this much quality time with the Fleet Star in a long time. And again, it's been doing a great job. I mean, really. It's a goddamn champ. Okay, I don't care about... I just need to get through this because as long as I get through this, I don't think that car will... The, you know, the scout, which I'm winching, I don't think it will actually get stuck on anything that's worthwhile around here. We'll just get... Yeah, there we go. Slipped around. You just imagine the guys inside the car going like, Oh my god, what's happening? What's happening? While the car just gets flailed around into trees and down crevices. That's fun for me to think about. Just, you know, their faces stuck to the you know, windshield and whatever, getting tossed around inside like uh, little pinballs. And then, you know, I, I deliver the guys to the auto repair shop or whatever, and he goes like, that'd be like a thousand bucks. Okay, let's low range this with the differential. Shouldn't have any 
real issues going through this, but you never know, right? Especially some dragging that uh, hunk of junk. I don't. Uh, I, th I feel the terrain so far that I've seen in Drummond Island uh, has been a lot kinder than uh, the terrain uh, in uh, the Smithfield Dam. I kind of wish it had stopped doing that, you know, trying to keep start the engine. I mean, it's out of fuel. Just stop doing it. Stop spamming with the messages. Okay, cool. So we're on the main road now, aren't we? Yep. Let's just... Uh, actually, we don't really need to deliver it right now. Uh, we can literally just uh, leave it here and continue our uh, scouting journey. Maybe we can finally find that uh, garage. Not that it would actually be any use for any use for us. Okay, so yeah, let's just leave this here. We'll complete it in another pass. Break, uh, please, and okay, let's head out. have an abandoned ship to explore at some point. That's cool. But for the moment, all I care about is that garage and maybe some refueling options. This. Let's. Okay. Let's head through there. We have a lot of trees around here, so we don't really care about us getting stuck in the mud. We can totally pinch ourselves to safety. Although I'm not have idea where I'm heading out that way. I just slid out of uh, position. Another watchtower, which would be nice for us to easy, 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 easy there. There we go. Uh, this doesn't look like a garage again. Saying if the, the map doesn't have a garage, I mean, it should have a garage, right? Surprise Pikachu face. I'm running pretty low on fuel here. By this point, I'm, I don't think I have enough for a return journey to the trailer park to actually fill her up again. We are not going in the water. Thank you very much. Okay, let's take this carefully just because there's, there's only just a few dead trees here that we could winch to in case we're running into trouble. But, uh, okay, 
not a big deal. We're actually fording this quite successfully. Pretty sure that we would have done a poorer job of scouting this with uh, the actual Chevrolet than uh, we did with the Fleet Star. Okay, watchtower opened. That gives us two objectives. But does that give us a garage? Does that give us a garage? Nope, guess not. Hmm. Hmm. That's disturbing. Again, the service trailer doesn't have any fuel. It only has uh, repair points and wheels. Nothing we really care about. So, we should probably, by this point, I mean, I'm wondering if this is crossable, because I'm not sure we have enough fuel left for us to play around. I mean, maybe we unlock this watchtower, but that's, I think, about the limit of my uh, abilities. In regards to fuel. Oh, actually, is this bridge not completed? Oh. Well, I'm, I'm glad we uncovered so much of the map, but still. Hmm. You know what? No, let's cancel it. Let's just cancel that because we're so close here. Let's, uh, actually, let's turn off the engine while we're thinking. Let's uh, move through here. I think uh, I can totally get up here and save us a bit of time. So I can come through here, through here, through here, through here. Uh, where did I leave that truck? That tiny truck? Uh, sure. Okay. Let's also grab that truck while we're doing it. That's just a small side grade. And go back here, we're gonna be doing that. Then head back to Smithsville Dam. And... What's wrecked to Smithsville Dam, we have an option to refuel at the trailer park there. Turned into a pretty overlong adventure. I just, I just wanted the garage, just to unlock it on this map. But apparently, that's not as easy a request as I uh, initially thought. Okay, let's. Can we just do this without anything? Just low range and differential. Yeah, but it is faster with uh, four wheel drive. I think it's pretty close in regards to fuel. Okay. Let's turn off the all-wheel drive whenever, whenever we really don't need it. This is my thing I wanted to try. Uh, but you know what? Let's cut a bit on the insanity. Let's do it on daytime. I can barely figure out what's going on here. 
can we winch ourselves? I mean, the range is pretty great. We just need a tiny wee bit of... Well, never mind. I don't think I even need a winch. This just hauls enough ass on its own, apparently. Yeah. I was hoping to see where I'm going, but... go. That's perfect. That got us straight through. Okay, I'm not sure what task this is. Oh yeah, this is the one with the abandoned ship. Let's just accept it so we have it accepted. Not that we're going to be doing it anyway, but let's head out. Let's turn off the all-wheel drive. be coming this way, but let's just reverse into that uh, scout. Than a, a normal left, not a marine left. Props to whoever gets that reference. Okay, good. This is solid. Let's get that little truck closer to us. Okay, that should be enough. 57 liters? Yes, 57 liters is gonna be enough. I have no idea, I hope so. Okay, this looks like a bit of a muddy section, but it wasn't. care if their engine starts anymore, they are just coming with me. Monk. Fifty-one liters, huh? absolutely no problems with this, that'd be great. You got the car out. I figured you could. Now I'll, now I'll check them under the hood. Check under the hood and let them know all about the ahem, very expensive damage they've done to their vehicle. Thanks, pal. <laughs> sure. Enjoy cheating out the locals. Well, not the locals, sorry, the tourists out of their uh, tourist money. For us, I think that's enough fun in Drummond Island. Let's get back to Smithville Dam. I'll uh, bring in um, the Chevrolet proper scout for that area. But not now. So where did I leave that trailer? I think, yeah, I think I left the trailer. near the trailer park. In case you're wondering what trailer, uh, last episode we got this trailer out from some deep ditch somewhere and uh, we were supposed to take it to uh, somewhere deeper in the area but we went on a little sideboard trip. So, uh, let's do refuel. Again, this is cheesy but it is what it is. And let's also do a repair. Let's do the 
and repairing was an actual problem we had. Let's grapple onto this. The attached trailer. Okay. There we go. Uh, what's what was this called again? Tools delivery? I think it was tools delivery. You have to deliver the curtain curtain side trailer which is this one all the way there we are gonna go the long way around I mean I'm sure there are some shortcuts here but these curtain side trailers are pretty annoying because they're so top heavy uh, it just makes me not want to really risk it to keep me on track. I mean, it would have been really easy to just follow this, but I like having those uh, check marks uh, in front of me. Not check marks, but your know, checkpoints. there was a funny meme with uh, the, um, the trailer stations oh, it was with uh, you know th that friend meme friends meme where you had the little panels and you have Phoebe going to Joey and saying like a single word and uh, Joey following along until at the end when Phoebe says the whole uh, sentence just Joey says something entirely else uh, so it was like uh, Trailer, uh, store, ah, refueling station. <laughs> hmm. I'm pretty sure that meme is less fun if I actually uh, tell it out loud, but oh well. have half a mind uh, when we get off this mountain to uh, check out uh, that upgrade near the quarry I'll be fair, uh, for a second there I thought we lost it uh, the trailer just because it didn't get its wheels on the on the bridge properly, but apparently that wasn't the case. Thankfully, because well, I, I don't know if thankfully, if th if this thing would have fallen off the mountain, I think it would shorten our journey just because we could pick it up at the bo at the bottom. Because uh, this route does just snake around. Whoa, 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 whoa! Easy there. I mean, this is exactly the point where the guardrail stops. <laughs> you know, <laughs> we decided. You know what? Here we will not put any guardrail. I think 35 miles per hour is a bit generous for this area. But that may just be me. So let's be careful. Let's be careful. Let's take it this easy. Let's not toss ourselves off of this cliff directly down. But man, is this trailer heavy. Maybe I just got used to uh, the fleet star without any load, but I think this trailer is quite hefty.
easy, let's because we have absolutely no guardrails here. That was a z Do we have a flat? Oh crap. We have a flat on a steering tire. I'm not sure how, how well this will drive. Man, that was such a bad hit. And we have zero options to repair, and we still have a fair bit to go. Okay, let's all wheel drive. Let's no compromise this. That was a hit I really did not want to take. Thankfully, this doesn't drive all that bad, I guess. Long live run flat some. There, this is the quarry on the right. Terrible, terrible quarry of doom. to drop this okay the quest was tools delivery I think so warehouse right warehouse okay Here the loading hub running smoother already. Nicely done. Okay, cool. That was 270 XP. How are we with the XP? We are literally 10 XP away from leveling up to level 10. Um, let's uh, get this repaired. And I think we'll uh, call it a day after that. Wow, it's been pretty adventurous for the last... Uh, uh, episode or two. I think we'll, uh, next episode, we'll probably go and check out that uh, local upgrade uh, near the quarry, which we've seen earlier. Uh, this one here. And maybe we'll uh, 
get this out of the water, International Trans Star. I think we can keep it. I think the quest for it, the Fixer Upper quest, which requires us. Oh, wait. Fixer Upper? Oh, right. So we have a truck here we can actually get, and it will be one of ours. Cool. And so. What's this International Trans Star that's here? Is this just a regular truck I, that I can get? And that's it? Huh. Well, I guess we'll uh, see in the next episode. But for the moment, let's just get this repaired. And I have no idea where these rocks are from. I didn't bring them in and they were not here before. In any case, let's get ourselves a maintenance trailer. Let's get ourselves repaired. Cool. And let's get ourselves, ref sorry, refueled. Trader store, let's sell it back. And yep, yeah, I guess this was it for this episode, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. If you liked this, uh, please uh, do a like, share, subscribe, all that good YouTube stuff. And I will see you guys in the next one.